Okay, guys, hello. This is Bay Baker, also known as, you know, Braden Blacker. This is the first episode of the No Breaks podcast. Mm-hmm. I am here with, you know, a very special and amazing, you know, I'd say at this point, a best friend of mine, Nevada, Nika, Veronica, you know, so many, so many so amazing many names. names. So many yeah. names. So, so many, many names. names. One of the most interesting people that I know has, you know, done so much in her life is, you know, a content creator musician artist pretty much does everything creative i feel like and you know i i get to you know have the opportunity to kind of break down her story and this will be the first time that you know first you've time? really you've well okay well we <laughs> we may or may not have like tried this a couple times but this will be the first time that actually makes it makes it on finally. youtube finally finally after like a couple of months a couple, couple of months, months that uh you know nevada story gets to come come out you know yeah guys i'm talking about my life Fourth time? For the first time, yeah, yeah. Not for the first time, but for me it's fourth. Is it fourth? Fourth time, fourth yeah, time. yeah, yeah. So, like, where do you want to... Oh, yeah, no words. Thomas. Oh, yeah, pick up, pick up. Hi, Thomas. Please leave your message. He called me, <laughs> he's like, pick up, and he didn't answer. Actually, Thomas should be the, the next <laughs> guest, but... We failed the heck us. Is Thomas, what's wrong? <laughs> All right, so right now Nevada's calling Thomas to see if he's Hi, Thomas. pulling up. Um, Nevada, we're getting a super mansion for the content house. Are you down to move in for like a week? What? Sure. A super mansion, like a really, really big house. When? <laughs> um, figuring it out. Yes, Talking sure, I'm done. I'm told. I told you about the agency. Yeah, they said there's like there's like there's like ten mansions we can choose from, and we're choosing right now. Really? <laughs> what? Yeah. That's crazy. Sure, I'm done. Yeah. I'll send you a link so you can probably see which houses look nice. Okay, sure. Yeah. I'm on a podcast right now. You want to say hi? What's up, gang? Yo, it's good. <laughs> We're talking about my life. Oh, how yeah. dramatic it is. <laughs> and how, like, you had, like, three husbands and, like, two kids. And <laughs> Yo, and two husband. kids is wild. <laughs> two kids is getting crazy, Thomas. You found an Asian boyfriend, and then you found another Asian boyfriend, and you had to find a white boyfriend. <laughs> complicated right <laughs> yeah right yeah. you totally yeah <laughs> that's crazy thank oh, that's you what I just to say. Okay. yeah thank you adios amigo <laughs> yes bro <laughs> all right so you know thomas thomas just said a lot thomas said a lot there <laughs> some of it some of it's true some of it's not true i have no idea what he's talking about 100 percent, 100 percent. yeah so you know the people online had do not know like they have not heard your backstory yeah where you come from you know, how everything True. started. So mm-hmm. I've heard this story probably about 40 times by now. Yeah. At you meetings. Know I know a lot. But yeah. for the people watching that, you know, love you, love your content. I you know, appreciate it so much. Which, Thank you know, you. she loves you if you love her and watch her content. You guys, you guys are the best. You support. I, I love if you hate me too. It's she okay. loves the haters. All She loves yeah, the haters love... maybe more. Maybe no, even more. no, not more. But I appreciate you guys. You know more about my life even even more, you know, even more about my love than my fans. So mm. Thank you. Okay, so Nevada, let's bring it back. Yeah. How did it start? How did you find out about social media? What are the oh. beginnings? The beginning. Okay. Um. From where we should start? Okay, I'm from Ukraine, from Odessa, the most beautiful place. My childhood i spent all my childhood at this city with my family and my friends i really i really miss them um so i was i was 15 i think hi ryan let me talk to quiet i'm so sorry (laughs) he's trying to break me It was my best friend. <laughs> Thank you. Okay, so I was 15, and my dad told me that I can't. Um, basically, I can't do anything. I need to go. Um, I need to go to school, come back home, do my homework, and like it basically. It. That's crazy. So like, no friends, no activities, no hobbies, nothing. And I'm like, what's the point of living? Just what's the point study? 
like yeah. what should i do i want to like i want to make friends how i can make friends how like how i can uh learn not re- not only like school lessons mm. like like something but like real life lessons life lessons it, yeah it yeah, makes yeah. sense so i try to um i try to hide from him that i'm hanging out with friends when i told him like oh dad i'm sorry i'm going to like um math like math class or something math class yeah. or something <laughs> like english class or whatever and i uh went to hang with my friends or wow. like i went to go work mm. when i was 15 wow where did you work i was dance teacher okay i love it i love it a lot sometimes i um i how to say, how to say that mm pull out the pull out the google translate i'm so sorry if you if you know nevada you know that the google translate is is one of your best friends yeah this is my best friend it's probably it's probably it's the only best friend that doesn't make you cry (laughs) (laughs) what okay it's It's probably your smartest best friend. okay 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 for example i missed a lot of like school classes yeah and i went to go work okay like for example when my dad drop me uh, near school mm. at like say um 8 8 a.m and he went back around like 4 p.m mm-hmm. to pick to pick me up all this time i was not at school i was in a dance studio and mm. worked because i needed money to like buy stuff for yep. content you know and i when he noticed that i'm trying to work and i'm as I, I asked him if i can go to um dance classes yeah it was a uh, hip-hop all hip-hop you know because <laughs> i i really like step up movie yeah and yeah. after that i was like ah, bro i should go to like dance classes and he's like no you're a girl you can go girl, you, <laughs> you, you can like wow. Hip hop is not for girls. Like, bro, what are you talking about? Who is it for then? <laughs> like, yeah, like, Who is it for then? what? And uh, I started hide it too. And then uh, I decided, th- I decided to try to like make a dance video for my social media. Okay, so that so that's the first, so yeah, the first thing you posted. Yeah, okay. I tried to post a lot of like, um, twenty twenty, no, twenty nineteen. Twenty nineteen. Okay. Yeah. So it was like basically all trends. It was dances, mm-hmm. you know, and I tried to film like dance video. Mm. I really like it. I really like this time. Oh my god! And I had it for the whole time. Mm-hmm. I had it because my dad was like, was my hater, <laughs> the biggest hater. He's like, oh my god, no, you can't do social media. What are you trying to do? Like what? Just go to school. Just you should start. Like what? And like yeah basically i just was at home whole time and the only one thing what i tried to do it like dancing mm. dancing on so tiktok and make friends so how many times were you posting a day when you started when i just started i don't know maybe 10 times a day 10 times a day yeah i was bored bro. so you're posting 10 times a day and what was like the first video that you had go viral oh <laughs> it was really it was really weird video. Mm-hmm. Like, basically, it was a lip scene for the really weird song. <laughs> it was Russian song. Okay. And um, I look like a drug d- drug addiction girl. Really? Yeah, it was really bad. My eyes was red as fuck. <laughs> <laughs> and I posted, but I don't want it to post it. I was mm-hmm. like, just for fun. Mm-hmm. And I have no idea why my eyes look so red in that video. Yeah. And I was like, I posted, I was like, I'll delete it in a couple minutes. And then I forget about it. And when I just woke up, I see like 100,000 views. Oh my God. Like, Guys, what's wrong? <laughs> Wait, so how like many followers, like at that time, how many followers did you have? I don't know, like 10K. 10K, okay. So from like 10K to a million, how, how long did that take for you? Oh, first meal is the most hard Mm -hmm. thing, I think. It was like two, three months. Two, three months. Okay. And what what do you think? Like Maybe four. Okay. Maybe five. 
what do you think like got you what was like the biggest moment you had between like 10k to a million like what really boosted you to another level Mm, i think i think it happened only because i was consistent Mm. and i posted every day and i tried to figure out how how tiktok works Mm -hmm. and what can be viral what can go viral and i posted like dance video trends a lot of different thing i tried to film every day my friend helped me a lot yeah thanks nastia <laughs> okay um yeah so it's so pretty. so you were posting a lot you got like your first million followers and then exo team reached out to you yeah um, okay so <laughs> <laughs> what's the question okay yes yeah, so i had maybe three three mil three million okay which is a lot like that is a lot of followers like that is definitely a lot i had three mil and at that time i think i was the one who filmed for like um english audience okay so like all my comments were american uh, yeah because i like it more than russian ukrainian Mm. all social media like because it's so different yep. it looks really different because i don't really like russian music mm-hmm. and i don't really understand russian trends sometimes like right now i have nothing like <laughs> on my for you page i have nothing russian and like yeah so i thought american trends american dances or american music for my for you page and for my like aesthetic or like what I'm trying to do, it looked better. Yep. Wait, what were we talking about? We were talking about so you hit you're at three million followers. Oh yes. You were living in Ukraine, and then how did EXO team find you? How did they uh, reach out? Like, yeah. So, Mary, Mary San and um, Stopa, they saw my video. It was like American trend. Okay. So that's why I started to talk about. Um. And they thought me and my ex-boyfriend, like, from somewhere, like, from LA or, like, mm-hmm. United States. And they, like, they liked our video, but they didn't know about me, nothing, like, mm. anything. Okay. And then, I have no idea how, but they realized that I'm from Ukraine. Mm-hmm. So, they, like, probably I can come to Russia. So, they texted me. I was like, yeah, sure, because for me, EXO team, it was, like wow crazy crazy like the biggest content house in, in the, the world. whole world yeah. right not now like <laughs> <laughs> so you know basically what? i'm here to talk shit about exo team all right so <laughs> 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 should we get into the <laughs> should we get into the job? all right so nevada what is the what is the topic of today's video oh i'm here to talk shit about exo team basically Okay, so uh, what were we talking about? Yeah, they texted me. Okay. I was like, yeah, sure, I can come. Mm-hmm. The worst part, oh, they asked me if I can, if I want to bring my boyfriend. I was like, yeah, sure, I want to help him too. <laughs> Dummy. You're like, I fucked that up. <laughs> <laughs> Dummy. You gave him too much clout. <laughs> you gave him too much. I don't care, it's fine. So. You were donating. So. I try to figure out how I can go from Ukraine to Russia because mm-hmm. my dad will never allow me to go to Russia. Mm. Why and was that? Because the feud, like the fight? No, it was before war. Okay. Even before, he just, bro, he didn't allow me to go out. Yeah, he didn't want you to leave. He, he like, you were his little kid, like. Yeah, right? he never okay. told, like, he always told me that I can go out, I can go hang. Mm. I, I, I should, like, stay at home. We're, we're talking about moving to another country. It's a little sure, crazy. No. It's a little crazy. Yeah, and I was 17, so, like... <sighs> yeah. So so then you moved to EXO Team. Yeah, I moved. And the worst, worst part, that when I just moved to Russia, mm-hmm. in two days, the war started. The war started. And I had a lot of hate, like, from everyone. In Russia? Or in Ukraine about you moving to Russia? Everywhere. Everyone was Everyone. Upset. Okay. They're like, you Ukrainian and you in Russia. You like, 
you really bad person. They just like Russian people hated me because I'm Ukrainian, yeah. and Ukrainian hated me because I'm in Russia, and I was stuck. I had no idea what I, what I can do, and even like in the first day, I started talk about war in social media, but they like they they don't they don't care at, at, like at all, Just and like. Yeah, I really didn't know what to do. I was, like, I talked to my mom, like, how I can help. And I tried to donate. And I tried to, like, make everything happen. Like, how I can move as soon as possible. But yeah. I had a boyfriend who's, like, Russian. And they... You wanted to move back. I wanted to move somewhere else, like, Europe. Because I can't. Like, my dad will not allow me to come back. Got it. So, yeah. Okay, so you're in Exo Team in russia how did you end up moving to the u.s how did that happen did it have to do with you wanting to move out because of that and everything with the yeah i wanted to move right after war started and i wanted to move one of the first like one um, once everyone just started try to move it was Mm -hmm. bambi dania boom um I don't remember Roma to break. Like a lot of people who tried to move firstly and okay. th- like I really to I really wanted to be one of them. Mm. But Stelpa is like our ex producer. Mm. He told me like Nika, I think you should stay. Because mm. you're a boyfriend. So here. he's like the good ex producer. Yeah, he's a good guy, but he's I He's a little bit better than Gary. I love Stopa. We love you, Stopa. <laughs> we love you, Stopa. But the worst part, like, I really wanted to go. Like, I really wanted to go. I don't want it. To, I don't want it to stay in Russia. But like, he told me, Nika, I feel like you should stay. And maybe it was right, but I don't know. I don't want it to stay in Russia. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, I thought he was gonna tell you to go. Wait, why do you? What was his reasoning? Why did he say to stay? Oh, he said like, I'm just seventeen. It's n- like no no one sure that we can like go because we tried to get visa in Poland, and no one get visa, and like he told me, I think it's not right time or something. <clears throat> also, because I was so lonely, I had no friends and I had only boyfriend there, and my boyfriend like s- will stay in Russia because he's Russian. My ex boyfriend, sorry. <laughs> mm-hmm. And, yeah, he told me that he feel that I should stay for a bit and try n- next time. And I don't know why. But maybe it was right. I don't know. It happened. Okay, so you... Everything happened. You and your reason. ex-boyfriend came to America. Yeah. And then... I helped him. So you helped him get to America. Mm-hmm. Um, you got the papers and everything. And then, you know, wha- what so was cold. that like? Mm? What was that like coming to America? Before we moved here, we lived six months in Spain. Six months in Spain, in different hotels. How did you like that? I hate it. (laughs) That sounds crazy. Like, imagine. I know, I couldn't. I really couldn't. I've never been to Spain. I mean, I want to go to Spain, but not for six. I I don't want to go for six months. No, bro, like, I love Spain. Maybe, like, six days, you know what I mean? (laughs) Like, I love Spain a lot. I love Spanish people. Um... Spaniards. Te amo mucho. Oh, okay, okay, okay. <laughs> but like, you speak Spanish a little bit? Maybe a little bit. Okay, muy bien, muy bien. <laughs> so, believe like the worst part is because we just waited for our documents to move. Yeah, so yeah, yeah. we didn't know for how long we should stay, and we didn't know for how long we like should like book apartment or something. That's Got why it. we lived in hotels. Like we all. That sounds very expensive. It was really bad. That sounds like a lot of money. <laughs> it was really bad. I swear to God, it was really bad. Guys, comment down below if you would... <laughs> how, how much you think that would cost to stay in hotels for six months? <laughs> that sounds crazy. So so you're in Spain. Then you come to Los Angeles, which is where we are now. Yeah. And what was that like when you finally got to Los Angeles? Oh, I like it. You like it? I like it a lot. Okay. It was my childhood dream, like... LA. Mm-hmm. 
you were in the city of angels the movies the tv the everything yeah so who was there like the original like who was there when you moved oh when i moved it was elsa danny boom which we we love elsa we love you i'm sorry you couldn't be here i'm sorry you're sick yep love elsa um so it was elsa danny boom mary um dash to kelly you don't know her veronica zoltva to um me my ex-boyfriend yeah i think that's it okay so i feel like i feel like we've done the backstory now i feel like you know you tell me you tell me but do you think it's you think it's time to get into some drama some drama some drama i'm always ready all right so you know if you know nevada I feel like a lot of people, your fans, your haters, everyone, they 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 associate Nevada with EXO Team. Not really. But like, I feel like I feel like that's like a thing. That's like a part of your your. It's it's a big part. Of it's my a big life, part I, of your brand. I feel yeah. like a big part of it. So do you wanna do you wanna tell them what happened this week? Hmm. Yeah. This is this this is the official announcement. Yeah. This is like the official announcement. Yeah. All right, Nevada, tell the tell the tell the people. I just. Left EXO team. The end. That is that is that is a hot take right there. Do you wanna? <laughs> can you go into like why? <laughs> <laughs> this is like five hour podcast, right? Five hours. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Can I like talk about why? Okay. <laughs> this is five hour. The bottle's like I need some. <laughs> you need to book this for more hours if you want me to go into that. Um. Honestly, I never felt that I, I never felt that I'm uh, like a part of EXO team. Never. Why is that? Um, you know, it's like a feelings when you. Wait, you always was in the same school or no? Have you ever changed it? Yeah, I was like mostly in like one school district. Yeah. Mm. So, when I just came to EXO team, it was already a, like, they was. They're like already a, a group. Okay. Cause they was like, couple years together yeah and everyone had drama everyone like was enemy each other everyone like had love <laughs> stories everyone like like they had everything and in like in the end of the day they like really i don't know just like family the group of people who know each other like really good yeah and when it just came i felt like um i came to a new school Mm -hmm. in the last year and they didn't like you not not like that I just feel i just felt weird like i felt like a stranger okay because i don't know them that much how they know each other yeah so i felt different i felt like i'm just i'm just here <laughs> i'm like a guest that makes sense you that know? makes sense i really don't know how to explain everything but like i really feel sad that exo team like already it's like falling apart. Yeah. Because I really don't know how it happened. It's like R.I.P. Like team. how they can let it happen. Yeah. Everyone left. Like whose fault do you think it is? Like how? <laughs> yeah. What do you think like caused it though? Like what? Like was it emotion? Was it like drama? It was, it was, yeah, it was like drama. Mm-hmm. Maybe. I don't know, honestly. It's like... Mm, how to explain? It just... People feel free in LA after they moved here. They like... They can feel they can... can they can do better without EXO Team. Because okay. EXO Team in Russia was pretty good. I feel nothing. Mm -hmm. We had, like, in the beginning, I really tried to give a chance, like, every fucking time. I was like, every EXO shooting was like, okay, right now, maybe right now will be better. Maybe today will be better. Mm -hmm. But no. Every time when I get, when I get to, like, EXO shooting, I was like, it's, it had, like, it's, worse and worse yeah. and worse and i was like okay this is my last time here and for the six months here seven months here i don't know i never missed 
any effects of the shooting. Yeah. Any of them. Until you quit. Yeah. <laughs> how do you feel after quitting? Like, how does that feel? Are you free? You feel free? What are you talking about? Like, how do you feel now that you left EXO? Oh, my God. Okay. <laughs> I thought of you about rape or something. What? I thought you about, like, weed or rape. I was like... No. I <laughs> you feel, no, 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 no. I know, I know, bro. I'm sorry. I'm just... What? I was like, what? Well, quitting? Mm? <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> That's a different podcast. Yeah, That's I'm Ryan's sorry. podcast. <laughs> 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 um, I feel... I feel free. You feel free? Yeah. Yeah. I feel like... I don't know. I'm just. I was There's still so one confused. more person we got to get free of. Who? I just don't get it. Like guys, like why would you want to like take money from someone or like hurt their like brand? Oh, this is one more thing. Yeah, go into why it. I left. Why'd you? Like it was the reason. Spill the tea. Because EXO takes fifty percent. I don't think anyone knows that. This might be the first time they're hearing that. I think so. All right, guys. So, breaking news. Uh, Exo Team takes, like, 50% of everything. Yeah. And it's too much. That's a lot. Like, that's a lot of money. Like, just imagine, like, if you were making, like, whatever it is, like, 100K, million. Like, that's 500,000 of a million. That's 50,000 of 100K. That's 5,000 of 10,000. Yeah, like, it's like a lot. I mean, it's a lot. Like, especially like if you're living in Los Angeles and America. I mean, it's so expensive. Like, everything. Like, you you want to fill up your car, it's like a hundred dollars. You want to like get Starbucks, it's like twenty dollars. You want to like, you know what I mean? Like everything, yeah. everything. Like America is like so expensive here. Yes. So, I mean, you know, and and you work so hard. I really feel like you work so hard on everything you post, everything you do, and your Thank brand. You. Like, no, no, no. I mean, I really mean it. Like, I think it's, I think it's bullshit. I really do. Everyone make sure to, you know, like, comment, and subscribe. Turn on post notifications. Um, you know, me and Nevada are going to be making a lot of podcasts uh, for the No Breaks podcast channel. And uh, we're going to be taking over YouTube, right, Nevada? Are we taking over? Mm-hmm. We're taking over. So, you know, just know we're taking over. Um, Nevada's pulling that up. And uh, also, I just want to congratulate, uh, you know, one of my close friends, Nevada, on hitting 100,000 streams. Thank you. On her song. Which is um, 10 times what the person that tries to take all her money got on a song. And it's been up for like less time. Oh, it's not working. Give me a phone. Know. I got you. I don't have Spotify though. I have Apple Music. Uh, okay. Are you now listening to like yeah. Nevada Ryan's friends? What? <laughs> yeah, I still I, I keep all the contacts. Guys, you know how he... <laughs> in his phone, I was like... Uh, I. You named me Nevada Ryan's friend. No, because I think it's funny because that's from like 10 months ago. Isn't that crazy? That's from when I met you. Okay. I'm so scared, Nevada bro. Ryan's friend. So <laughs> you dropped your first song. It's clearly about a guy. Who is it about? My first song? Yeah, you like. it's obviously about a guy. Like, who's that, who's that back. about? Yeah, who's, what guy is that about? Because you had a husband. I don't have a husband. You, oh, you don't. You used to. You're divorced. No, I divorced. You divorced him. Isn't it crazy? I'm 19 and I do worse. The people are wondering. I read. It some, was not real. I read some comments. It Is this song real. about Kalunia? Uh, I'll tell you. <laughs> <laughs> What's the take? Okay, so I don't want it to make a song about Kalunia. Okay, but you may but have. At the same time, I wanted to make a song about him only because I knew that <laughs> people were going to talk about it. But honestly, I don't fucking care about this guy anymore. Oh. All right, guys. Hot. The, the take is Nevada does not care about Kalunia. No, I don't. She's, she's, she's done. She divorced yes. him. She divorced him and it's yeah. done. Okay, so, uh, you know, you know, I, people want to, people, the people want to know. But yeah, it's a true story. About Kaluna. Okay, so so you left EXO Team. What are like your new goals now? New goals in life. Music. Music. Okay, okay, okay. One million streams. One million streams. Okay, so she just said a hundred thousand. I want me back. What is like the next song? Wait, le- let's check. All right, Nevada. Right Nevada's now. gonna check how many streams she has right now. Um, you know, I just wanna I just wanna do a quick thank you out to everyone in the chosen family. You know, we growing. We growing. One hundred. 
10k. <sighs> That's crazy. All right, guys. Nevada's at 110,000 streams on song. Nope. 20 people right now listening to this song. 20 guys, people are listening. that's crazy. Hopefully, like, we get 20 people to watch the podcast. That would be good. Yeah. Hopefully. We can, like we can me, dream. you, Ryan, my mom, yes. your mom. Yes. Ryan's my grandparents mom. Yeah, that are true. alive. We'll try. We'll, we'll try, try to we'll get try. 20. We'll get 20. We'll get 20. All right, Nevada, <laughs> what, what, what tea do you want to talk about? What, what drama? What, what are some drama topics you'd like to drama talk about? Drama topic? What's the drama topic you like to talk hmm. about? Any drama? What do we? What do you want to talk about? Okay, okay, okay. Any who are like? Who would you say are like your favorite artists right now? My favorite artist. Yeah, that like you look up to. Billie Eilish. Billie Eilish. Who yeah. else? Who else? Jaden Hustler. Jaden Hustler. The Kid Leroy. The Kid Leroy. Um, Montel Fish. De- De- David. David. Um. You know, guys, I'm I'm like sad as fuck <laughs> <laughs> so my music taste is like that um so what else who oh chase atlantic neighbor okay. the neighborhoods the yeah. weekend okay so like these type of music i like chill mm. I like sad mm. so i can just cry in my room every day okay i'm dead inside okay 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 <laughs> Fair, but fair. Yeah. So, Nevada, like, you know, right now, like, do you have a boyfriend? Are you single? Like, well, what's your love life looking like right now? Hmm? What, like, like, what's your, like, love life looking like right now? What are you talking about? No, I'm saying, like, you know, like, are you dating someone? Sorry, I'm just, you know, like, because I'm Ukrainian, I don't really understand English, so I kind of don't understand what are you talking about. Oh, you my know? bad, my bad, my yeah, bad. Yeah. Do you want me to say it in Ukrainian? Yeah, yeah, sure. Oh, Let, let's okay. go. You have 1%. Let's go. Oh, it died. Okay. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So I know. So you like apples. So like you like the letter A, right? Like, could that have to do with like your dating the life? Fuck or... What? <laughs> yeah. I like. I really confused. I have no idea what you're talking about. Like, I. Like, oh honestly. my bad. My bad. My bad. My bad. My yeah. Bad. Like. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm sorry for my English, for my accent, for everything. Yeah, Nevada, okay. Nevada. Sorry, she loves you. Alright. Uh, so, so like you know. Oh, I know what we can talk about. Uh, I'm me. really mad. <laughs> Gary? What? No. What are we talking about? About people. Like, bro, I found how people talk shit about me in a social media. What are they saying? Wait, tell me. Because they, like, bro, I have no idea what's wrong, but I feel like some people don't understand how social media works, and they, like, they really, like, they get mad that I'm filming with different boys, or, like, they get mad that I'm, like... Doing Who are the something. different boys? Like Asher, Justin. I don't know. Like all my friends, mm. you know, like Reggie, mm. Justin, Asher, Ryan. Like everyone. Mm. It's just my friends. They yeah. like they making drama around. Oh, Thomas also, and they making drama. Like I feel like Nevada pick me, girl. Can you just pick mm. one? I was like, bro, <laughs> this is, is just a video. Like with who I'm hanging out, and I have an idea what to film. I was like, guys, let's film it. It's nothing, like, it's nothing mm. about, like, oh, guys, do you really think that if I'm, like, if I date someone and I'm going to cheat some, with, but, like, i really confused, like, I'm not going to post different love stories with, like, different boys and, like, <laughs> waiting for people, they're like, oh, yeah. so you cheating with this guy, bro, what? <laughs> It's just a video. Yeah. It's just a trend, or it's just like anything. Like, what's wrong? Definitely. Okay, so how do you? How do you? You know, I'm sure there's probably at least a couple people that are watching that do content creation, social media, something like that. You know, um, that's one of the points of the podcast. Mm-hmm. I want like people that are content creators to enjoy it and like get something out of it. So, yeah. how do you deal with the hate comments? I don't care. But like, how do you get to that point where you don't care? Like, if someone if someone's getting really sad right now about hate comments, like, what would you tell them? What advice would you give them? Um, just don't care. <laughs> okay. But like, okay, okay. people who hate you, they probably um, they probably just want to be like you, or like mm-hmm. the people who hate you. I don't know. It's good to ha- have like hate comments. Good to have some haters. Like that. Cause like, they. I don't know. In my opinion, hater is like really specific fans. Yeah. 
they like they watching everything where you do they're doing. obsessed and they, yeah, they, they trying to find something bad like they yeah. trying to find anything and they like they like stalkers like they're they, like nerds mm-hmm. but so it's good though like it's good you like they they're gonna up your ego okay okay Does okay, that make okay. Sense? that makes that makes a lot of sense actually okay so you know what do you think uh how, how did you feel when uh ryan was driving your car last night bro, <laughs> bro. if you had to like rate ryan as like a driver from like the scale of one to ten like what would you rate him actually nine nine okay but sometimes he's doing dumb shit how fast was he driving last night? I'm waiting for him to come right Wait, now. Wait, how fast was Ryan dri- driving last night in your car? You want to get him canceled or get him <laughs> ticket? No, yeah. I'm not going to say. <laughs> yeah. I'm not going to tell him. No, nah, it, was, it was a video game. Like in the video game. In a video game. In the video game. Oh, yeah, yeah, true. 130 game. miles? Yo, that is, that is crazy. That's crazy, yeah. On the highway, kinda. right? In the video game. In, it <laughs> in the video game. <laughs> what the fuck? In the video it. game. <laughs> We're trying to cancel Ryan right now. Get him tickets. Go to jail. I feel like if we don't, I feel like if we don't specify and we just say it's in a video game, like he's fine, right? I don't think so. All right, so like, so, you know, as you've said, like you're not like dating anyone, in Nevada. Can you like, if someone's watching this video right now, you know, I obviously do like the red flag, green flag videos. I don't know if you've seen them, Nevada, but uh, you know. As as you said, like you know, you didn't say if you're dating or single. What are like you know, if a guy sees this video right now mm-hmm. and wants to like slide in your DMs, like what are what are what are what are you looking for in a guy in Nevada? Let's go. Just text me. <laughs> <laughs> you have no red flags, no green flags. No, I'm kidding. Like, what are your red flags and guys? Red flags? Yeah. Oh, it's a lot. Just like drop the list. Tell me, like, what, are, what are the worst <laughs> things in a guy? Um. <clears throat> Worst thing in a guy. Yeah, like what are some of the worst? If his name is Kalun- <laughs> okay, just If kidding. his name's Kalunia. <laughs> just kidding. That's a little specific. Just kidding. I know a lot. Okay, let's. I don't need red flags that crazy. No. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. yeah Kalunia true. is a little bit like. Like. That's that's like horrible. Yeah. That's like. That's the horrible. worst. That's like horrible. Horrible. <laughs> okay, so what are some like nicer red flags? Nicer. Not as bad. Okay, so. Guy, mm-hmm. I don't like guys who don't like what i'm doing and who not mm, haters you don't want to date a hater no like just the people who like oh social media is not actual work or Ew. something like that you know they're like social it. media is not work but i'm making more money than you bitch yeah <laughs> or like guys who like i like saving money but i don't like people i don't like guys who's like ill like ten ten bucks for coffee? No, you can like you can make it at home. It's like, I just want Starbucks. Oh wait, I like this. I like this idea. I like this topic. So, what are what are your thoughts? Like, what are your spending habits? Mm. Like, what's something you would spend a lot of money on versus something you wouldn't spend a lot of money on? I'll spend a lot of money on like content. On content, okay. But and. On myself, too. Okay. Because, like, me, myself. You're the followers. You're the brand. I am a brand, yeah. You are the brand. Like, I should look good. You like, are the brand deal. <laughs> I'm joking. No, but, like, I don't know. I like clothes. Like, I'm not going like to okay. save money. If I really like, because right now, everything what I wear is deal. Mm. What's, <laughs> like, okay, okay. What's, like, like, the most you'd spend on a hoodie? 3k 3000 on like a hoodie Balenciaga. On a bl- okay so like if a I hoodie if you see a hoodie it's like 3000 you'd be like i'll buy it if i really like it okay. if i like really 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 if it's really like just like a plain black hoodie f- no. for 3k fuck no okay cuz i'm not going to say names but his first name's Ryan and we're at Balenciaga and there is a plain ba- black hoodie for for 1200 and thank God I convinced him out of getting it. That's crazy. Would you buy that? A plain black hoodie for 1.2K? No, okay. Thank but, like, you. like, sometimes uh, I have, like, this black Z from Balenciaga. And it's, like, one small stickers. But I really like it. I spent, like, 1K, 1K 300 for a Z hoodie. 
Guys, and, I don't know. I don't know if it's just me, but everyone in the comments, please comment right now if you're feeling broke right now. <laughs> no, but like, bro, I feel I feel broke right now too. But like, you feel broke right now? Yeah. What is I'm what does broke feel like to you? Like, explain that. Like, what is broke right now? What is that feeling? What is that? When I can't go buy. <laughs> when you can't go buy Balenciaga. When the no no no, I'm kidding. Okay. Like when I. I don't know. I just well, feel well, broke caused, after. I think after I know who moving. caused you to be broke. No, I feel broke after moving. I just moved. Like, yeah. Actually. Wait, what are we talking about? I'm thinking. We're talking about red flags and guys. Oh, Give me some actually. Red flags, red flags? Yeah, red flags. Yeah, let's talk about boys. Talk about boys. Yeah. Okay. If people hate that I'm talking about boys and I'm filmed with boys, let's talk about boys. Let's talk about boys. Who cares? So, who cares? All right, so, so like... Red flags? Yeah, what are your red flags? Give me some more red flags and guys. And mm. then you have to give me green flags. Like, what are you liking, guys? Mm, mm-hmm. So, red flags? Yeah. If they don't like my friends. Okay. Is it like a... Is it... Okay, okay. Is it a red flag if a guy doesn't, like, pay for dinner? Like, on the first date? Oh, it's fine. That's fine? I don't know. I never was on a date. What? i never been on a date. You've never been on a date? Do you think, like, if you're on a date, like, a guy should pay for the dinner? Yeah. I agree with that. Do you think this I've is interesting? I've never been on a date. I'm You've date. never been on a date? Guys, Vada hasn't been on a date, but she's been married. Bro. <laughs> that's, that's fucking wild. I had I had two relationships for like two You've years. You've never been on a date? No, no one like actually invited me. Like, I want to invite you on a date. Not even Apple? Bro, what? I'm just calling him Apple, so like I don't say the name. You know what I mean? Oh, no. No? No. <laughs> What? Like no one never asked me. Yo, like, you know who you are, bro. You gotta take the bot on a date, bro. That's crazy. Like no one actually tell me like, I want I want to invite you on a date. They like crazy. Let's go hang out. All right, guys. I'm gonna be honest. You want to tell you like my my tactic? Yeah. With girls. Okay, let's go. Okay, let's guys. Go I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna spit some some Bay Baker bacon up. Mm. Okay, this is my Bay Baker baked go. goods right here. All right, so so Ryan Ryan Ryan's outside, but uh, Ryan knows like you know I riz up. 24 7 right ryan ah uh, he's out there <laughs> <laughs> false don't believe this man ah <laughs> uh, so yeah so so pretty much like you know what i do is the first mm-hmm. thing i do is um you know i like like getting to know the person so like i'll send a lot of like messages back and forth with them whatever um mm-hmm. probably do some facetimes because mm-hmm. i like like looking at them like face to face and then i kind of feel like a good first date is like a restaurant, like kind of because you can get really get to know them well. What's your favorite food, by the way? My favorite food? Yeah. Like place or like? No, yeah, just food. Oh, my favorite food, sushi, sushi, no doubt. What's your favorite food? Sushi and Korean barbecue. What's your least favorite food? Fast food. Fast food. Yeah. You know what? I, that's why I didn't like about LA when I came the first time. People like people were only eating fast food around me. Really? I'm not used to it. Really? I don't eat fast food. My mom, like, my mom, I, I, up until I was, like, you know, maybe 11, I only had fast food once. Like, my parents never gave me fast food or anything like that, really. Really? That's smart. So, if, like, a guy took you on a date and it was a fast food place, that would be a red flag, right? Yeah. Okay. What are some green flags? Like, you know. Green flags? Yeah. Hmm. When they care about you when they care about you and then they buy you gifts no no not really i feel like I gifts are kind of like i don't really i like giving gifts. gifts i don't like getting gifts everyone like both i think you like both i like mm, i feel I like, like if they care presents. about you and give you gifts that's like a w yeah but like when they like i'm talking about not gifts only like even when people don't care about you, they can just give you a gift. That's true. But, like, okay, what about, like, gifts when they actually made by themselves? Yeah. That's so do you like cute. guys that, like, have, like, their own, like, do you want someone that does content creation or, like, does something different? Sometimes I thought that, I, like, after Kaluni, I was like, I'll never date a TikToker. So, so what changed your mind? Um. So you were like, I'm never going to be with someone who does content? Actually, I don't know, like... It depends on person. Depends on the person. Yeah, but what about green flags more? Like, like personality? Are they funny? Are they nice? Like, when they, 
When we have the same la- like love language. Same. What is your love language, Namada? I think quiet time and like touch. Touch. Okay, so quiet time and touch. So like you like more of an introvert, like someone yes, who has their own time and all that. I think that's why you like music. You like mm. all that. You're like very relaxed, like yeah. chill. You're a chill person, guys. Namada yeah. Namada's a very chill person. You have to know that about her. Stop hating on her. She's a very chill, nice person. Don't stop is fine. Or don't stop. Maybe just keep <laughs> blowing up the comments. You're making her... This is what you guys don't realize. By commenting, you're just making Nevada more money. Yeah, The so haters just make you more money. So just go for it. I feel like, you know, we should we should, we should should talk about the music stuff a little more. So yeah. what are, like, your goals for the year with music? With music? Yeah. How many songs do you want to <laughs> oh, have, out, have out this year? Like, when do you think the this next song... This year or next year? When do you think you're going to, like, plan on releasing your next song? I don't know. It depends on um, me, you, and Ryan. But as soon as possible. I'd say, like, the goal is January, February. Not February. It's two. January. Mm-hmm. Yeah. It, like, we do want to make a Christmas song this week. Yeah, but. You down yeah. for that? Yeah, I'm down. But I want, I'm actually, at the same time, I want to um, do in my song, too. Yeah, yeah. We'll get a I want to make setup. more music. Yeah, we want to make more. It's like your goal to like have concerts and events and all that. Oh, right. I want to... I, I dream... My dream was a tour. Mm. Like my own tour. If you could like open up for one artist, like be the performer before they perform, who would it be? Open what? up is like when Taylor Swift has a concert, she has like another artist that plays right before her for like 10 minutes or 20 minutes. Jaden. Jaden Hustler. Mm. Or Billy. Or Billie Eilish. What What do you like about Billie Eilish's music? Everything. I feel like everything. She's like she's she's so gorgeous. Her music, her voice, her style, how she talk, how she took. You just love Billie Eilish. I love Billie Eilish. We gotta get you to meet Billie Eilish. My dream. Guys. Someone we gotta someone comment down how how we get Nevada to meet Billy Eilish. She's so good. We need. I feel like we need to make this happen a collab. Uh, she's so good. I like. Okay. I can. I right, Nevada. You know we're coming. We're coming to like the end. So. Oh. Yeah, what's see. like What's like on your mind? Like what are some things you want to just get off your chest? Like how are you feeling? What are like some hot takes you are feeling right now? Hot takes. Give me some hot takes. Let's make more music. Let's make more music. More drama. Let's make more drama. What are, what's like some drama you're let's, planning on starting? Let's let's make more music, drama, and money. And take down XOT. Exot- <laughs> <laughs> oh, we're gonna go film reality shows, Ransom. Oh my, that is exciting. So it will be a lot of drama, bro. That sounds very like a lot. There's gonna be a lot of drama there. Yeah. I am. I am excited to see that. Yeah, same. Oh my God, I'm gonna need the footage. I'm going to need that footage. And where is that going to be? On YouTube? Uh, on YouTube, I think, yeah. We're going to go to Vegas Ooh. for a couple of days to film all this stuff. We're going to film like 24 hours. <sighs> 24 hours? Yeah, bro. It's Who do you think is going to create the most drama, if you had to guess? Thomas, me, Ryan. Okay. I th- I think you're going to be crying a lot. <laughs> yeah, I know. <laughs> you're going to be crying a lot. <laughs> Ryan going to be... Uh, I hope Ryan's crying a lot, too, during the show. <laughs> no, he's going to do like some dumb shit, I think. Yeah, Ryan is a silly boy. But he's really good in like conversations, you know. So yeah. whenever I'll cry, he's like, "You know what? <laughs> Let me tell you something." And yeah, he's a really good friend. He is a good friend. My best friend. That's a good friend right there. He always was here for me when I f- like when I felt really bad. Mm. He helped me a lot. He and drove I- your car home. <laughs> Yeah, I trust him. After he cr- almost crashed his car, well, after like, he crashed, not almost, he did, cra- he, he, did, did he did crash. He did crash his car, and I trust him. Yep. To drive my car, the like the which day is after. more expensive. I have no idea. I never drive my car. It is. Okay. It actually is. Okay. Are we gonna whisper for the next? <laughs> yeah. So. So it guys, so Nevada's means, thought yeah. was after Ryan crashed his Model Three Tesla that it would be a great idea to give him a more expensive car to crash. I just trust him. Yeah. So we actually played a video game where 
Stop. Guys, 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 guys. <laughs> Hey, hey, hey. Everybody listen, listen up, listen up. I'm about to crash your car tomorrow. Yo. What the yo, fuck? Yo, yo, Ryan does not care. Ryan, Ryan, what I love about Ryan what is like, right, let me just, let me just have a quick minute just to, just to show my love for this man. Yes. Like, 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 Ryan does not care. <laughs> like, <laughs> seriously? Yes, really. I told... I just told how like I pr- I appreciate you, bro, and how I love you, and you just come to say that you're gonna crash my car tomorrow. That's crazy. No, like, I mean, Ryan's parents were just like mind blown that um, you know, he had another car in the driveway, so he went to he went to Walker and told Walker that he bought a new car. Walker believed him, it was like shit talking him. What? Cause he hates that car. That's, oh. like, his least favorite car. Oh. But it's so cool. Like, we were driving it, like, in a video game at 130 miles an hour. In a video game. And it, it it's pretty fast. In the video game. So. Honestly, fuck this PG shit. Fuck you, Brayden. You're a snitch. <laughs> Yo. You're a snitch for real. <laughs> yes, you are. <laughs> Guys, I love snitching on Ryan. <laughs> <laughs> so Nevada, like, what are your life Two goals? Minutes. Like, what what's what is the next steps in your dream life? Music, just music. Do you want to have like and tell fucking mail on TikTok and verified everywhere, bro? Yeah, why are you not verified everywhere? What I happened? have no idea. Meta, TikTok, YouTube. What's what the hell? wrong? I'm sad. I have almost ten mil on TikTok. I'm not verified. I have almost four million on YouTube. I'm not very far. Uh, I have some questions. If you had to delete one one platform, what would it be? <laughs> Facebook. Facebook. <laughs> Whoa, Meta. I don't know how Meta's going to like that. <laughs> Your Instagram just gets taken down. <laughs> okay, no, 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 no. I love Facebook. <laughs> um, Probably Snapchat. What's up? What's up? Um, Telegram. That's meta too. <laughs> I don't know. You keep taking shots at Fuck. meta. You're, you're never getting verified <laughs> Okay, now. Vika, Vika, it's Russian app. I don't care yeah, about yeah, this yeah. app. Fuck, I, fuck that. Bye. Bye, Gary. <laughs> what the most interesting you heard today about me? What's the most interesting thing I heard about you? I mean, I just think it's so interesting because I don't think like anyone actually hears your voice that much. Oh, yeah, true. And now that we're going to have, like, a show where we can interview people and they can, like, hear your voice. Probably people don't really like my voice. Cause well, when well I was, maybe. Uh, how when would I, you know? How would you know? Because I saw the comments, bro. Like, well, fuck I, uh, the comments. Don't we, we don't care about the comments. No, I know. But, like, sometimes, you know, I was in a Oh, so sometimes we care about the comments. Stop. So I was in a mm, famous birthday. It's like a show or, like. Never heard of it. Famous birthday, What is bro? famous birthdays? The most late thing. Sounds bro. like the worst show I've ever heard. What? Sounds like no. a horrible show. Huh? So I would never want to be on. I'm joking. I know what it is. I know what it is. So famous birthday, and I was there with Elsa and people. Yo, like, famous birthday is. <clears throat> can I? Can I please get on? My friend got on at 100k on Instagram. Please put me on at 100 when I hit 100k. Okay, so I was in a famous birthday, and like they posted something about like, like apart from the video, they yeah. posted it was me and Elsa, and oh. we. I don't remember what we talk about, but like they ask us questions, and since mm. I'm not like fully like my English is so bad, okay, yeah, and like it's actually pretty good. Not Let me really, tell you. but like thank you. I'm trying. I'm like I hope I get better. So like I was in the famous bros day, and I like tried yeah. to talk normally, like I'm used to talk, and like they asked me something and I don't get it but they asked me so I asked it again like I, I'll ask for to repeat it or something and like uh, when I talk I was really quiet because I felt not really comfortable because I just saw these people and people in the comments like mm, why why she talk like why she speak English she's <laughs> Ukrainian why she's trying to be English why is she trying to be like a like why is she act like a pick me girl? Wow. Why why is she doing that voice? Why like why is she talking okay, in English if she's Ukrainian? Let like, me tell bro. you something. Nevada. <sighs> all I have How to say I is I can talk in Russian or exactly. Ukrainian when I'm in like America. America. In America. America. This is America. This is America. Don't catch you slipping up. 
Uh, so, you know, all I got to say is, Nevada, out of all those people commenting, there's only one person on Famous Birthdays, and it's you. Exactly. So, fuck them. Nobody cares. Nobody cares. Nobody that cares. is the first episode of the No Breaks podcast where we talked about Nevada quitting EXO team and <laughs> how we don't love Gary Gray. I <laughs> have a good one. And uh, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Turn on post notifications. I wait. So, Nevada, uh, you know, let's wrap it up. How are you feeling after this podcast? Honestly, I want to be on your side right now and ask someone questions. You want to like, ask people questions with yeah. me? Yeah. You want? Can I? I don't know. Honestly, care about I'm that. down. You can ask questions with me. Let's do it. Let's do it. Run it up. Run it up. Run it up.